were at Leader Chuck Systems. They visited AMB Stuttgart 2016. There, they secured sole distribution rights for the rotor eye jaw boring rings. Let's go. Let's go. Mark, rotor eye, we saw it there stand at a recent exhibition, but what on earth is it? Okay, well, what it is, is it's a jaw boring system. It's a, a system of a series of rings that are used to assist in the boring of soft blank jaws to, so that you can bore them with the profile that you want. And I've been tasked by our German principals to introduce this as yet unsold product in the UK to the fine engineers, precision engineers of uh, the UK. Okay, so... New to the UK, what are engineers doing at the moment? Well, there are many, you know, engineers are surviving without these, they're, but, they're, but they tend to be, uh, I guess, using ad hoc pieces of material, billets where they'll, they'll clamp a billet, turn the jaws, uh, the profile into the jaws. But just by using a billet means you can't machine the, f the full face of the, of the clamping face of the jaw. Um, maybe they could put a ring on the outside of the jaws and clamp that, but then the jaws are being uh, 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 clamping in the wrong direction to clamp a, an outside diameter. So this enables us to, to uh, uh, provide a solution for both of those. So at the moment then it's pretty much engineers, a bit ad hoc, they make their own they do. component. Yeah, many, many times. But what I'm thinking with this is that a, you know, a shop, a precision engineering shop, could invest in, in, in uh, a set of these and they would then have a method, a consistent method, wh which all the operators can use to machine their, their soft jaws in situ. So you said consistent, so consistent and standard, but and you said a set of them, so what yeah. sizes do they come in? Well, there are, this, this set is called the LX set, yep. but I can show you here um, that there's a small set and a large LX, XL, XXL, um, which is very, very big. Yep. Also, these are for three jaw chucks. Yep. Um, there's a set that are, or sets that are designed for two and four jaw chucks, and there are sets that are designed for three and six jaw chucks. These will only do three jaw chucks, this set we're going to look at today. Okay, so all sizes of chucks, yeah. all sorts of jaws, but you said previously, very easy to use. Yeah, let me show you. I'll, I'll show you now how to do it. Okay, let's have a look. Okay. So, Mark, really simple to work with. Yeah, I, I think it is. It's, uh, it's set up now. We can machine those soft blank jaws that are on the chuck face in situ. They uh, will be held mid-stroke. You can machine away the desired diameter of the workpiece you want to hold, and you can do machine the full height of the jaw away, which you, you can't do with other, other ways of doing it. So full depth of the jaw, but also internal and external? Oh, yes, yes. This is, this is going to clamp externally. So if we want to do some ID work, we would turn these bolts around 180 degrees. We would clamp the inside diameter of the ring mid-stroke again, and then we, that would allow us to machine the jaws away outside the ring to the desired inside diameter that you want to uh, clamp on your workpiece. What a cracking invention. I, yeah, it, 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 it is. I think, uh, I think it should go down very well with uh, UK engineers. But I've got another one. Ah, one you prepared earlier? Well, yeah, one I prepared earlier. Any idea? Absolutely none whatsoever, I'm afraid. Okay. It's called Posi Stop. Um, if you imagine once you've machined your jaws out, you're ready to go. So you're going to put your first billet into the chuck. But because it's an open centered chuck, you need to know, you need to s stop it. You need to, to be consistent in its positioning. So what we've got here is a series of posi stops. They come in many different widths, which then means you can have a different various um, depths of, of, of uh, location. And as far as installing onto the chuck that you're gonna use the posi stop on, it goes on like this. Simple. Absolutely. <laughs> Another cracking invention. Thank you. Thank you.